All right, so our first step is let's make a folder to put all our stuff in. Okay, so this is my data file right there. There's my, uh, my paper, right? Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to do a, for me, I'm just doing a double tap, right? And I'm going to make a copy of that guy. And then I'm going to click on that guy. I'm going to make a copy of this one. And then I'm going to make a folder. So go up here, click new, new folder. And I'm going to title it with my name. There we go. And I'm going to put this in that folder. So this folder is what you're going to share with me. And now if we open this up, right? Uh, and I can, you can name this whatever you want. Let's rename this. Uh, Murray Chaos. How's that? Murray Chaos. And uh, copy of doesn't quite do it for me. So this was, I think, this was uh, uh, bubbles coming out of a big pen or something like that. Okay. Okay. So that is. Uh, let's see. We've done this. We put the research into a folder titled with my name. Replace the IB code in your paper with your actual name. So let's see. So there's some IB code, right? Let's replace it with, because hey, this is an IB, right? Okay, um, this is a paper I wrote in the 90s and it, it's about, um, you know, a dripping faucet becomes chaotic. Uh, and so the question was, does uh, bubbles coming off of a nucleation site from boiling, does that also produce chaos, right? And, and the answer I got is probably, but I didn't really get any definitive answer for other issues that I had, right? Okay, so I've replaced the code, and then notice how this is like, you know, I'm going to print this on paper, so it's got page breaks and all this stuff, right? So what I wanna do is I wanna make, go up here to File, go down here to Page Setup, and make it pageless. And this is how you make it kinda, it's sort of like gonna be like a website, sort of, that's its thing, right? So now it's just like, ooh, that's nice. Here we have it, right? All right, that is the exciting first step.